Hello everyone, Fabulous Leo was doing an Intel 10th gen core kit unboxing video and today I'm going to dig further into it with PC build based on kits I received from Intel. Here are the components that I've been using throughout my video and with no further ado, let's go right into the details of the components. For the case, I'll be using a night clock metal case from Aerocool and this one, I think, can accommodate all of these components with each. For the main board, I'll be using a Z49 Aeros Master on here, but this one is coming with the kit. For the CPU, I'll make sure here, I'll be using the Intel Core i9 10 gen 1900K and for the next video I'll be using the Intel Core i5 10 gen 1700K for the PC build. So stay tuned to that. For the cooling system I'll be using the ID cooling Zoom Flow 36X RGB LED. This RGB LED can be compatible with the Aeros Master Fusion. You can use one with the other main board makers as well such as Asus, MSI and ASRock. For the gaming system I'll be using the palette of GeForce RTX 2017. I think it's enough power for me because I play Dota 2 most of the time. To power on all of these components, I'll be using the Aerocool P7 750W Platinum. For storage solution, I'll be using the Western Digital Black SN750 1TB. And for extra saving power for other workloads like editing and encoding videos, I will be using SN550 from Western Digital as well. This one is successor to the Western Digital Blue produced a couple years ago. For extra solution, I will be using the Seagate Barracuda 8TB HDD for, you know, saving some other stuff like videos, photos, and movies, which doesn't require much power when used. And lastly, for the RAM, I will be using the HyperX Furious Kingston 16GB of burst 3200MHz. Let's go right into the building process.